guys, I made candle holders. The details around these candle holders look like ice frost, hence the name Chain Frosty Candle Holders. I'd like to share with you how I made this, now let's go ahead and get started. The two main items I'm going to be using will be these tea light candle holders and glass candle holders. I prepped the tea light candle holders and I spray painted them silver. This is what it looks like. I kept them aside and then I took the glass and I'm going to be adding two together, gluing two together and then the both ones glued together will be glued on a single candle holder using an E6000 glue. Next thing that I did was to glue all of them together with the candle holder that was spray painted. And I turned it the other way because the bottom part is what fits most with my candles. Next, I'm gonna be using two inches and one inch mirrors to decorate the candle holder. If you're new to my channel, it's so great to have you here. Now don't forget to click on the subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of my latest videos. This is what it looks like, and now I'm going to be repeating the same thing for the other side. To cover up the openings, I will be using gems. The gems is what's going to give it a frosty look like this, and I'm loving it so far. Now the next thing that I'm going to do is cover up the upper side, it's going to take the candle and the lower side. And I'm going to be using gems that I got from Walmart that comes in a string. I'm going to hold it on with a hot glue gun because it tends to want to fall off. So this is what it looks like. And now the bottom part, I'm going to be using larger gems. And I'm going to be gluing it on with a hot glue gun and an E6000 glue. And I also glued more gems at the top. Or should I say the one that's closer to the mirror? And this is what it looks like. It has more of a frosty look. And for this part right here, I'm going to be using the core pieces that were left over from another project. And the link for this project where I used the core pieces is going to pop up at the top of the video. When I was done, this is what it looks like. It is so pretty. Now for the smaller one, it's the same thing, but I used just one glass candle holder at the bottom. This is when they are side by side together. These candle holders are so pretty. And if you look carefully, you would see that they kind of have frosty looks because of the gems that were used all around the candle holders. I lit them up and I really don't know why the other one is not coming out with the light properly, but then I just love the overall look of the project. Let me know what you think about these candle holders in the comments section below and remember to like and share. And also remember to turn on your notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my latest videos. Thank you so much for watching. I have other videos linked in the description box below to check them out and don't forget to click on the subscribe button.